Now we're back to CapCut. Let me show you how you can create a glitch text effect. You can create it once and then use this as an overlay for videos. So let's just keep the timeline empty. I added a fall text. Make this your text. Let me just say glitch. Then pick a font. You may have to download one. Lots of them are free. Be careful about the pro ones. You can add a style. Make it a bit bigger using font size. Change the color. It's the base color. Doesn't usually affect the glitch effect. Once that is done, right click on it. Create a compound clip. I'll put it to video channel 1 and now we'll add the glitch effect. Under effects, video effects, you will find a glitch category. You can also search for it in the top search bar, but I don't believe that it actually can detect all of them. Sometimes I have an issue with it. Let me, for example, try fuzzy. It should be there. But it can't find it. So maybe I've done a typo or I haven't written it the right way. But let us go over the glitch category a little bit. For example, a color glitch, which is this RGB split. And for most of them, you can adjust the direction of this glitch via the aberration in the X and Y scale. So lateral is always X, longitudinal is the Y scale. Here's the chromatic. Most of them have a speed adjustment, which just makes it flicker or glitch faster, slower, and strength is for the intensity. But I'm pretty sure that there's a fuzzy inbuilt. So let me check that again. All right, there it is. And I'm certain that I've written it that way in the search bar, but it couldn't find it. So sometimes you just have to search for it. But here again, we have the aberration, the strain for the intensity and the speed. What you can also do is you can create multiple of these blocks. So this glitch effect, I'll size this down, add start and end a little bit. So it's regular text and it glitches, then it's regular again. On here we can let it glitch again. Press Ctrl C, Ctrl V to copy the glitch effect. And this is usually something that you want to have. Hope this video was helpful, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.